Protect your kids. Protect your elderly. Protect the community. Camden's mayor said this was the next necessary step. Walking the streets with Rutgers Camden nursing students, going door to door and car to car. We're offering vaccines today, tomorrow. No one wants to go back to last year. It was a dark time for our country, for our city, for our, the state of New Jersey. We got to fight this. And we're going to tackle this by zip codes. Starting with the ones hardest hit by COVID-19, walking over a mile through the Centerville and Whitman Park neighborhoods, answering questions and concerns. Sometimes it's that simple. Um, some people hear stories, social media. You got to explain to them that's entertainment. Those aren't facts. Some conversations were a success. I'm going to take my granddaughter with me. That's what I'm going in there. Oh, God bless, man. Others were not. She's afraid of needles, and that's an easy concern to overcome. And folks like Dante are still on the fence, even after losing his uncle to COVID. I just haven't made a decision, you know, not having health issues. When it comes to at least one shot, Camden has reached 56% of eligible residents. This nursing student sees every conversation as another opportunity. I'm trying to, you know, ease people's worries. What's the biggest worry that you're hearing? Um, they, like, they don't trust it yet or they want to see how it plays out. Melissa said it was just the nudge she needed. It's very important because people my age, they, they getting it real bad and they dying from this and I'm not trying to leave my kids or my grandkids. We've opened up vaccine sites, we've vaccinated thousands and it's been great, but now it's time to meet them where they are. And this vaccination push will continue in these neighborhoods for the next few days. And then the plan is to expand. In Camden, Matt Delusha, NBC 10 News.